Hey, what's up everyone and welcome to yet another unboxing video and I think this is like what the fifth or sixth one in the last week I, I like to unbox my, my games sorry uh, but this time it's not for a PS4 game or the PS4 in general this time I am unboxing Xbox One games and you can expect a lot of Xbox One related stuff unboxings impressions reviews in the next come you know, in the next few weeks including PS4 also but uh the first three games I got for Xbox One are Assassin's Creed 4 Black Flag, Battlefield 4, and Assa oh, no, says Assassin's Creed. Call of Duty 2014. That's what I'm calling it. So, because it's, it might as well, it com comes out every year like Madden. Uh, so, I am really looking forward to Xbox 360, I mean Xbox One. I had all these games on Xbox 360 and I traded them up at Best Buy, 10 bucks each extra, and I got the Xbox One editions. Now, one thing that sucks is that I did not finish any of these games, so that means I think I have to start all of them over. Luckily, I can actually uh, play this one. Like, I, I can get my friend to let me borrow his Xbox 360 version and then play it through. Uh, I've ha I didn't have time to play it all the way through. I'm really close, so if I cannot continue my save on this, which will suck, then I will play it on Xbox 360. But uh, I, I, I really do want to play this again, because I, I really, like, at least the beginning, I really love, okay? You know, no, no spoilers with my review. Everything else, like, I wouldn't mind playing over again, seeing that the campaigns are really short. Uh, Call of Duty, that's not Call of Duty. Call of Duty, I got almost all the way through. Battlefield, I play, like, the first mission. So, you know, Battlefield doesn't matter. Call of Duty, I'll play it over again, because it's short. It doesn't matter. Um, anyway, let's unbox them. All right, the first one, let's do Call of Duty first. Also, this is kind of like a sneak preview in... Uh, what the w w what the Xbox One boxes look like? That's what they look like. They're like the size of a, uh, a Blu-ray. Actually, I think they're pretty much the same size as a PS4 game. Yep, same height and width. Well, height definitely. Uh, width. It's a little bit chunkier. The PS4 game. A little bit chunkier, if you can tell. Um, but it's a it's a little thinner. It's more like a Blu-ray case. Oh, I have an exacto knife. I'm waving around everywhere. I'm going to slip my fucking throat. Okay, on accident. All right, let's open this. If you can't tell, I'm still tired. I just unboxed a Lego superhero game. And, yeah, if you saw that unboxing, you know uh, I was pretty tired. And I'm going to be real tired in the next coming days. All right, what the hell? Did they just threw this in here. Okay, let me put that down for a second. First thing I get is an advertisement for the Season Pass and Destiny. And this was folded up in there. So they just like, yeah, just shove it in there. Go. And just threw the game out to sell. So that's kind of weird. Um, I don't have anywhere else to put this stuff. So I have to put it on my bed in the background. All right. Luckily, I got another code for the Free Fall multiplayer map. I will not give it out for free only because I think, I'm not sure, I think... Uh, the map does not tran you know transfer from 360 to Xbox One. Season Pass does because it's like a you know it's a it's like attached to your gamer tag or something. But the ma the map itself is uh I don't think is is so I'm not gonna give it away. Sorry. Uh, and here's what the disc looks like. That's what it looks like. The Xbox One label on the top. It's green. It says Xbox One. And oh look at that. Blu-ray, you can see my camera. It's all nice. Look, oh, that's that's where I usually record my videos. That's cool. Uh, so yeah, Blu-ray disc. Don't know why. I just realized. I don't know why the the CD placer is over here on this side. It usually is on this side. But anyway, the background is just a warranty, like usual. So there you go. There's Call of Duty. It's pretty much the same, except it's in a 360. I keep saying that. Xbox One case. Next one, let's do Assassin's Creed 4. So, Assassin's Creed 4, here's the front. There is the back. It's pretty much the same. And here's the side. I get another Ubisoft Passport, which I think does transfer from 360 to Xbox One. But, again, I'm not going to give it out, just in case I'm wrong. Like, some things I know do transfer. 
like the season pass for Call of Duty and even Battlefield, I'm pretty sure those definitely. Uh, but those are things I would never give away anyway, because that's like worth fifty, sixty dollars. Uh, I mean, if I had an extra one, sure. But if I didn't, then fuck that. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> that's mine. Go away. All right. All right. So here we go. You get another. Oh, this one's. Is this a little different? I think this might be a little different than the Ubisoft Passport I got before. This one, here's the code. I'm not going to show you, but that's where the code is. I'm not going to show you all of it. Here you go. You get you get a little bit of it. You're not going to figure it out. Um, and you get like a little folded up piece of it. I guess like a folded, I don't know. I, I'm really tired. I don't know what I'm saying. Uh, you got a black beard, I guess. No, no black beard there. I don't know what I'm looking at. There you go. Should do this some other time. Uh, and you get an advertisement for Watch Dogs. Damn, over 90 awards and nominations. Uh, Assassin's Creed Liberation HD. Assassin's Creed Initiates. I don't know what that is. But uh, there you go. Watch Dogs, 90 nominations. Assassin's Creed Liberation HD. And just, there you go. More ads. I mean, it's Xbox One. Gotta gotta show them what. This one does the same thing. The disc is on this side where the cover art is. That's weird. I guess that's just how they all are. Also, this one has the PS4 things that have like the little lips that stick out. So I guess you can't press onto the case. If you saw my Knack and Killzone unboxing, you know what I'm talking about. But uh, this one does, but Call of Duty doesn't. That's kind of weird. So anyway, that's the disc. Again, the background is a warranty what it looks like. I think it's a little bit different than the 360 one, but I can't tell you because I don't have it anymore. <laughs> also, it's only one disc. Both of them are only one disc because, you know, future. Because, you know, future, you know. And now Battlefield 4. There you go. There you go. go. Battlefield is awesome. What does it say? Only in Battlefield. That's their tagline. That's why they put a trademark after it. <laughs> only in Battlefield. All right, and I mean, Call of Duty has their stupid tagline. Oh, there's a soldier in all of us. No, there isn't. I'll be a. I'm a pussy. All right, I, I'm not a soldier. Shit, shit blows up. I'm crying. They not hiding. I can't even do. It. I'll probably piss myself. All right, first thing, I, of course, you get an advertisement. Big fucking surprise. Uh, you get an advertisement for. Damn, we get a lot of advertisements in this one. Uh, three. Uh, you got a Titanfall advertisement. You got a, what the fuck? Oh, well, a dice store advertisement. Then you got Battlefield 4 premium advertisement. Then you get this, which I think is just a warranty, because there's no warranty on the back. Oh, I just noticed this. The Xbox case has like a, if you can see, yeah, you can. It has like a uh, Xbox symbol embroiled on it. I don't know. It's like kind of bumpy on there. Uh, and you got the Battlefield 4 disc. There you go. And of course, that's a Blu-ray. So that's it. Battlefield 4. There you go. So that's all. That's, that's it. <laughs> that's everything. So those are all the Xbox One games I got so far. Uh, Xbox One comes out in a couple days. I'm really excited. I will be going to, hopefully... That hopefully I will be going to the midnight release tomorrow, but who knows? Uh, I have no idea, but um, I might be. If I'm not, then I'll definitely get it on Friday. I have it pre-ordered. have plenty, plenty of money. I have way more than $543, which is exactly how, it co how much it costs in New York, so after tax and stuff. So I have plenty of money. I got plenty of money, and I'm going to be getting Killer Instinct, which I heard was good. Crimson Dragon, which I heard was not very good, but I love Panzer Dragon, so <laughs> I'm gonna get it anyway. Uh, I'm gonna get Loco Cycle, even though I heard that wasn't very good. Uh, Dead Rising 3, which I heard was pretty damn good. Uh, and Rise, Fighter Within, I'm getting Fighter Within. Uh, Forza, I'm probably gonna get Forza. And I'm gonna try to get either Need for Speed, or I'm gonna get Zoo Tycoon from Walmart. I don't know, either one. So I'm going to be getting a lot of games. That's like 10 games right there. Actually, it's probably more considering I didn't name off the games I just showed you. So there you go. There's uh, Xbox One unboxings. 
I hope you enjoy it. Thank you. And uh, I'm tired. Goodbye.